We're looking over these teams, Smitty. Very strong play from their front courts. Uh, what do you think about this matchup? It's going to be a great one. Each of these teams are so solid up front. It's strength versus strength. And now the opening lineup for Phoenix. Barkley is out there with West. Then it's Marlon. Then it's Sabalos. And it's Johnson in at the point guard position. Now here's McCollum. Williamson outside. Six to shoot. Back to McCollum. Pass to Valanchunas. And it's sent back by West. Barkley against McCollum. Barkley, and that's good. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rack. And, and where's the help defensively? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Now here's Williamson. Pass to Ingram. It's Jones on the wing. New Orleans needs to get off a shot. There's Williamson with the three. And here's the break. Here's Barkley. Drops in the breakaway layup. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. It makes sense, right? You're trying to get off to a fast start, and he can help with that. Outside, Jones. Pass to Williamson. Back to Jones. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. So, Greg, when you think about the Phoenix Suns, what do you think fuels them the most? Kevin, I mean, the fact that they had a 2-0 lead in the 21 NBA Finals and lost. This team is really battling to get back to that stage. And if they do, they want to take care of business this time. He doesn't get the second one. Steve, we've talked about this. A great job by the Pelicans front office in surrounding Zion Williamson with talent. Yes, Kevin. When he's healthy, they're one of the best teams in the league. But to go the distance, he has to be available. Now here's Ingram after Kevin Johnson's miss. And Williamson throws it down. Great ball movement by B.I. Spots a wide open teammate and feeds him. Sabalos against Jones. Sabalos passes to Marley. West to screen on Ingram. Feeds to West. And the rejection by Valanciunas. Those are the plays you want from Valanciunas on the defensive end. Didn't hesitate to challenge the shot. McCollum deciding where to go with it. Down low. And that one's good. Williamson. Williamson's got his second bucket tonight. He's looking confident right from the opening tip. West a screen on Jones. Jones against Sabalos. A putback. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And so here is New Orleans. They come into this one following the loss to the Mavericks. They, they didn't play well in that second half. Had a big lead, but just didn't sustain the momentum and ended up giving it away. Just five to shoot. Williamson dishes to Valanciunas. Off target from outside. Just a, enough coverage to bother that three-point attempt. West setting the pick for Johnson. Over Jones. Shot by Johnson. No good. Very dangerous to leave a guy like that open. Lucky break there for the deep. Ingram passes to McCollum. That's good. And it's Ingram with the assist. Hasn't seen a three he doesn't like. CJ takes a ton of them. The feed to Barkley. And Barkley throws it down. This guy is a high flyer. I mean, especially for a power forward, and he needs to be as an undersized player. McCollum against Johnson. McCollum, no good. The Suns have gone four for nine from the field to start this game off. And the rejection by Valanciunas. Sabalos against McCollum. He feeds it to Williamson. And Williamson throws it down. His assist numbers have grown. C.J. McCollum, 
pass on time. The Suns trailing. Barkley with a screen on McCollum. Johnson against McCollum. And the pass to Barkley. That one is good. He's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor. This is why you're trying to get him as many touches as possible. He's got the deck. McCollum outside. To the middle. Stolen by Marley. Pass to Johnson. To the inside. Good job of stepping up to the plate there. Seizing back the momentum for his team. That's the competitor in him. Close game. Let me have this one. Cullen passes to Valanciunas. Barkley against Williamson. Pass to Valanciunas. McCollum kicks to Jones. Here's Ingram. The rebound by Marley. The Suns have gone 6 of 12 from the field here in the first quarter. Barkley left side. Alan Junis grabs the board. Alan Junis has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. And finished off by Williamson. With the reputation of a highlight reel dunker, Zion's always ready to put on a show. Nice angle on that replay with the AT&T 5G slam cam. And for the Suns, they're shooting the ball at a 46% clip to start this game out. And Smitty, you think about the years McCollum played with Damian Lillard. You have to believe they made each other better. I totally agree, G.A. They both have high standards, always working on their games. That's why they're two of the best guards in the league over the last decade. Look how Ingram just bursts inside, disrupting the D and carving out a path to the dunk. On the wing, Johnson. He's guarded by McCollum. Shot clock at five. Sabalos gets the bucket. And so McCollum will bring it up for the New Orleans Pelicans. Williamson outside. It's Ingram on the wing. Six on the shot clock. Fires the three. Rebound by the Suns. Barkley's got six rebounds here tonight. Now the dish to Johnson. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. Chemistry at its best. An unreal alley-oop. Yeah, the, you're right. The pass, the catch, the dunk. All of it perfect. So for the Pelicans, Trey Murphy's checked in for Zion Williamson. Daniels comes in for Jones. And it's Jose Alvarado in for McCollum. And the Suns here with a different look. Chambers is checked in for West. Miller comes in for Barkley. Dumas is checked in for Marley. And Danny Ainge is subbed in for Sabalos. Alvarado with it. Covered by Johnson. And it's Alvarado missing. The defender took away the airspace, crowded him. That changed the shot. The shot by Ainge, no good. New Orleans gone, just one of four from three-point range here in the first. Miller with the block. Dumas against Valanciunas. Dumas the pass to Johnson. Miller sets a screen for Johnson. Over Alvarado. Johnson, good. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Now here's Ingram. He had a 30-point outing their last game against Dallas. Falls through. He's now made two of four. Showing some nice handles in the pick and roll. Ingram's creativity is fun to watch in these sets. Johnson outside. Miller sets a screen for Johnson. Goes up on the wing. Elegance pull it in. Doesn't register as a block, but he did everything you want defending that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good job of contesting without committing the foul. Trying to attack the heart of that defense with great teamwork. 
First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Got to admire what he's been able to do at the free throw line this season. How about over 90%? Looking who's out there now for the Pelicans. Seller comes in for Valanciunas. And Zion Williamson subbed in for Brandon Ingram. Now, here is Ainge. He had an 18-point outing in their last game against Boston. And if you look at his free throw numbers, you can see what kind of pressure he put on the defense. He was in attack mode all night long. Here's Alvarado. The Suns getting the bucket. He kicks it to Zeller. Passes it to Daniels. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Phoenix ahead, leading by just one. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with quarter number two. And this has been a fairly close game through the first quarter, and we'll see what happens here in the second. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Suns. They are making a statement so far on the defensive end, sending shots away in incredible fashion, loving the hustle. And another thing they've done so well is convert fast break opportunities. Great job trusting their guys and getting those easy ones. We've got Zello. Trey Murphy is out there with Zion Williamson. Then it's Jose Alvarado. And it's Daniels in at the shooting guard. So that's the group out there for New Orleans. And Phoenix has possession. And the Pelicans picked up three with their last shot. And there's the pass to Barton. Williamson with the block. The swat. Zion saying, hey, try someone else. And any chance you get, you want to put yourself in a position to succeed, and that's what he did there. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. Now here's Knight. Eight points his last outing. Ainge with the ball. Drills it from outside. Ainge has got himself on the board with three there. Not just a knockdown shooter. He does a great job of finding space for his shot. Alvarado passes to Zeller. This is the baby hook. Just strong work defensively there in the low post. You got to be tough down in the paint. He did a nice job of keeping him off the block. Didn't let him get deep. Another one goes. Incredible. And this is all you need to know about the year he's having. He's coming up on the single season franchise scoring record. And when he does get there, I bet it's a long time until someone matches it. And, Greg, when we get to the playoffs, how important are adjustments over the course of a series? Uh, that's what it's all about. I mean, that chess match and the ability to find a plan B. And, and Kevin, over a seven-game series, you've got to be able to adjust and adapt. And the foul on Dyson Daniel. That is his first foul of the game. Some changes for New Orleans. Jones comes in for Trey Murphy. And it's C.J. McCollum in for Jose Alvarado. C.J. McCollum. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Chambers with a screen on Jones. Shot clock at six. Tries it from nine. Puts it up from seven. Uses the glass to drop it in. Chambers got the lead up to four now for the Suns. That's outstanding decision making there to change his shot and find an open teammate for an easy basket. Daniels passes to Williamson. Shoots over Barkley. And it's Williamson missing. And it's the Suns ball. It's been eight unanswered points for him. Knight kicks to Ainge. From outside off the mark. And so McCollum will bring it up for the New Orleans Pelicans. They faced off right here last time they met, but the home club just couldn't pull out the win. And turnovers were the story for them when they saw each other last. I mean, just a heartbreaking way to lose the game. Beautiful pass by Jones, keeping his head on a swivel and creating the wide open look. They set the screen. Now, here is Ainge. He's covered by Daniels. The shot's good from Ainge. 
Pelicans trail by four. Outside, Jones. Back to McCollum. Kicks it out to Jones. Fires from deep. A three-pointer is right on target. Some of Jones's minutes are dictated by how well he shoots the three ball. Screen by Barkley. Knight wide open. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Knight's got the lead back up to four now for the Suns. Cullen passes to Zeller. Williamson against Barkley. Pass to Zeller. He dishes it to McCollum. Fires away from outside. Phoenix grabs the miss. Barkley's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Shooting at a high clip, he's found ways to get quality looks. McCollum outside. to the paint. Here's Williamson and Williamson throws it down. This is how dangerous a scorer Zion is. Outstanding at putting his team on his back. Barkley outside. Down low and stolen by Zell. And here we go. Williamson heading to the hoop. This is where you like to see Zion go to work in the lane, where his size is a decided advantage. Is ready? You want to talk about explosiveness? This is your man, Zion Williamson. Kevin, I mean, when he was in college, he blew through a shoe, making a cut. He's so strong, Kevin, the leather couldn't hold up. Jonas Valanciunas, he's checked in for the Pelicans. Brandon Ingram comes in for Dyson Daniels. A big group substitution here for Phoenix. West is checked in for Chambers. Marley comes in for Dumas. Sabalas is checked in for Ainge. And it's Johnson in for Knight. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thank you, guys. Zion Williamson is a force to be reckoned with, but Coach Willie Green said he's just scratching the surface. He's going to continue to get better. Over and over again, he's making the right play. Kevin? All right, DA, thanks. Ingram outside. Back to McCollum. Green Nance is checked in for Zion Williamson. Outside, Jones. Barkley grabs the board. Barkley's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Sabalos passes to Johnson. To the middle, five on the clock. Sabalos kicks to Barkley. Some nice ball movement here by the Suns. Marley no good. Pelicans trail by five. Column, no good. Meeting right at the rim. He typically converts in those situations. Not this time. Pass to Marley. And here's Mark. Johnson outside. From past the arc. And it's Ingram with the rebound. And Ingram has got the ball here for the Pelicans. They host the Spurs after this one. That'll be the last of three straight at home for the team. And the basket by McCollum. What touch on the floater. CJ is tough to guard when he gets this going. Johnson, the pass to Barkley. Double team on Barkley. On deep, Marley. Rebounded by Valanciunas. New Orleans has gone two of four from three-point range so far in the second quarter. And Jones slams it home. A defensive miscue, and her Jones made them pay. The Suns have gone 7 of 14 in the second quarter, shooting to the tune of 50%. West a screen on McCollum. McCollum against Johnson. 
And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. It's on Jonas Valanciunas. Here we are, Smitty, right smack dab in the dog days of the season. How are the bodies feeling, you think, at this stage of the schedule? Kevin, if they tell you everyone's 100% healthy, that's just not true. Avoiding major injuries is huge for a team. But all players deal with aches and pains throughout the course of the season. Zion Williamson's checked in for the Pelicans. Ingram outside. Floats it up for Williamson. It's clear that Zion knows his strengths. Good at sensing when he should shoot it. And first time out of the game called for Phoenix. And checking out some numbers for him. Here's Johnson. He's coming off a 10-point game against Boston. Passes it to Sabalos. Kicks to Marley from the arc. Nailed from three-point land. And the Suns lead by four. And Thunder Dan Marley, a lights-out perimeter scorer, a talented shooter from deep. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Johnson surveying the floor. And Valanciunas pulls it down. Valanciunas has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. McCollum with the screen for Williamson. And the dunk by Williamson. Teams know that Zion's a great offensive rebounder, and they still can't stop him. Johnson against McCollum. Johnson, the pass to Sabalos. The Sun shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. And the first one drops. At the line for the Sun. Sabalos taking two shots. And so Sabalos nails both of them. And they're really getting more points at the free throw line here in the second quarter. Ingram outside. There's 48 seconds left in the second quarter. Back to McCollum. Tries a three. It's rebounded by West. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Johnson with it. Now guarded by Ingram. Johnson can't get it to go. And it's just one of those days, guys. He has just struggled to shoot the basketball. And the dunk by Williamson. When Zion dunks it, you can feel it from here. That's how powerful he is. Jones against Sabalos. Chambers with a screen on Jones. Here's Sabalos. Sinks the triple. Sabalos has got five points now in the quarter. And boy, he's really in a groove. Dominant performance last game. Same thing this time out. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Suns lead by three. From New Orleans, back in a moment. You know, for Phoenix, they've been phenomenal. All the lofty predictions, the expectations, they've all come true. Now come. Getting back to the New Orleans Pelicans, what a tight first half. They're falling behind because they're missing from the outside. I think they need to find a new recipe, one that doesn't rely on the three ball. Yeah, that would be insanity, doing the same thing and expecting a different result. You know what they got to do, big fella? They got to feed the post. They got to get it into that. And that is a wrap. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. You look at Zion Williamson, guys. In this game, he has been everywhere. 
Yeah, and just look at the numbers from the first half. He has been very efficient. And it's not like everything's been at the rim. There's been a number of jump shots along the way. Setting the floor for the Suns. We got Zabalos. West is out there with Barkley. Then it's Marley. And it's Johnson in at the point. Here's Ingram. Four on the clock. Over Marley. That's in, and the Suns lead is cut to just one point on the basket from Ingram. You see how Ingram's polished his game, looking smooth from the mid-range. On the wing, Johnson. He is guarded by McCollum. The pass to Sabalos. Barkley with a screen on Jones. Here's Sabalos. Another shot, and he lays it up and in. Barkley's got 19 points. Well, you like how aggressive he is making a play at the rim against Lynch. And let's forget the height disadvantage. He brings the effort, and he brings the energy. McCollum against Johnson to the inside. Ingram, and slammed up by Ingram. With that impressive wingspan, Brandon Ingram can sure make plays above the rim. Last a screen on Jones. Right at the free throw line. Pelicans with the rebound. Valanciunas has got 11 rebounds in the game. Looking at the veteran Jonas Valanciunas, Steve, he remains a nightly double-double threat. He's someone that likes to flex his muscle on both ends, Kevin. A big man who uses his size to his advantage and is reliable at cashing in from inside. Williamson against Barkley. Connects again. And for this franchise, he's now tied the record for most points in a single season. That tells you all you need to know about him offensively. He is ultra savvy and ultra skilled. Ingram kicks to McCullough. Valanciunas passes to Williamson. New Orleans moving the ball around. Hands it from downtown. Ingram's got seven points for the quarter. How about the confidence from Brandon Ingram? Knows what it takes to knock that one down. Johnson against McCollum. Marley with a screen on McCollum. Johnson outside. Trying to break that ice cold streak, and it's Phoenix scoring again. And, and Johnson just superb at shooting the basketball. This is a high scoring point guard who knows how to create space for his jump. McCollum outside. Inside. Stolen by Marley. Johnson down low. He is guarded by McCollum. West setting the pick for Johnson. Over McCollum. Johnson finds West. And the dunk by Mark West. And some hang time on the rim. Puts a little cherry on the top of that slam. Well, those kind of displays of strength can get one team rolling. And Jones has it in the corner. Pass to Williamson. It's Ingram on the wing. A three-pointer, no good. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Here's West. Rebounded by Alan Junis. Alan Junis has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Williamson against Sabalos. Ingram wide open. No good on the triple. And yeah, that old adage about being too wide open, not a thing. Good, he hits again. And he's done it. A new single season franchise scoring record. Great accomplishment from him in what's been an incredible run. It's been a season for the ages for him, and one that will go down in the history of this franchise. Valanciunas passes to Williamson. McCollum dishes to Ingram. That's in, coming off the assist from McCollum. McCollum's got assist number nine. Wow, what an effort here tonight. McCollum against Johnson. Over McCollum, and it's Phoenix scoring again. 
be a quick trigger. And from that range, if he senses the defenders have backed off, forget about it. Ingram outside. To the middle. And Ballinger has kicks to McCullough. Launches a three. Rebound by the Suns. West has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Johnson against McCullough. Now here's Marley. He's guarded close. Here's West. And then jammed down as he goes right over Zion Williamson. He's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead. And here we go, baby. It is showtime. Awesome rewind courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. Ingram outside to the inside and it's Williamson missing I wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the backboard Sabalos passes to Johnson Williamson against Barkley over Williamson and he makes the bucket gets the whistle and now a three-point play chance here for him and that keeps him perfect from the field this quarter. Trey Murphy's checked in for New Orleans. Ainge has checked in for the Suns. That one misses for Barkley. Pelicans trail by seven. Now McCollum, he has five. Ingram outside. They set the pick, launches it. Barkley grabs the board. On offense, here are the Suns. They're on a 14 to 6 run. Johnson, the pass to Barkley. Some solid defense from Ingram. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession, except for the result. Pass to McCollum. From beyond the arc. Trains it from beyond the arc. McCollum's got his third bucket of the night. And the D has gotten a little bit laxed here, defending the triple. Passes it to Sabalos. Looks for Barkley. Gets it to him. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. He. Phoenix, no good that time either. Pelicans trail by four. And it's McCollum in the corner. For three. Barkley grabs the board. For Phoenix, they've gone better than 53% from the floor since halftime. Shooting 8 of 15. Feeds it to West. Plays it up and banks it in. West has got six points. 152 left in the third. Dishes it to Ingram. McCollum outside. Here's Jones. And it hung on the rim, but wouldn't fall for him. Here's Barkley. And Barkley slams it home. Wow. And that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg. That is definitely an emphasis jam. A big apostrophe or exclamation point. Maybe even a question mark. Here's Ainge. Here he goes. And easy two points on the layup. Seven points in the game. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter. The pass to Valanciunas. Over West. And the shot is good. The Phoenix City has been cut down now to just eight on the basket from Valanciunas. Valanciunas has a look from the mid-range. He is very comfortable taking it. Sabalos against Jones. Here's Sabalos. He's got 11. Barkley controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Yeah, that's the third bucket in a row from the paint. This defense needs to clog those lanes in the middle. Four seconds separating the shot. 
The Suns making a switch here. Sixteen seconds left in the third quarter. Pass to Williamson. Lock at six. Chalk up two there. Williamson's got 21. No one can stop Zion inside. He's a physical force. The three from Johnson. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's the Phoenix Suns in the driver's seat. Up eight points at the end of the quarter. Their lead is where it is because they've gotten good shots. A lot of good shots. Here now a chance to show you our assist of the game. And it's presented as always by State Farm. Uh, just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Execution. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. Jose Alvarado is out there with Daniels. Then it's Cody Zeller. Then there's Williamson. So that's the group out there for New Orleans. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. And hammering down the two-hand slam. Here's Alvarado. He's guarded by Knight. Alvarado with it overnight. Rebounded by Chambers. Chambers got four rebounds now tonight. Yeah, and they've shown effort and aggression in the paint, really right from the tip. Their rebounding edge right now, massive. Here's Ainge, and it's Phoenix scoring again. Yeah, that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. And he's been a force on the glass all game long. He has led this team in rebounding and also taken on the role of enforcer. Pass to Zeller. Phoenix. The Pelicans making a switch here. Nance is checked in. First team foul. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. Here's Alvarado. He's guarded by Knight. That's in, and the Suns' lead is cut down to just 10 points with the bucket from Alvarado. Knight taking his time here. Passes to Chambers. Pelicans with the rebound. Out left of the wing. Here's Williamson. No good that time. Good D by Ainge. Suns leading by 10. Outside Knight. Chambers with a screen on Williamson. Knight passes to Chambers. Can't cash in from close range. For New Orleans, they've gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. Let's it go from 11. It's hauled in by Dumas. For Phoenix, they've gone two for five on field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. Moves back up, and two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. That one on Nance. And Chambers is aggressive when it comes to getting to the line, using his height and length to get under the skin of the defense. Valanciunas, he's checked in for Zeller. Sabalas has checked in for the Suns. Here's Alvarado. He's guarded by Knight, and it's Alvarado missing. The struggle is real. He's been way off with this shot all evening long. Chambers. Nice deep from Valanciunas. Pelicans trail by 13. Here's Alvarado. Oh, good with the triple. He has gone ice cold this quarter. Obviously not helping their calls. The pass to Sabalos. Here's Chambers, covered by Nance. Now, here is Barkley. Down to five on the shot clock, and the shot goes down. 
Barclay's got 31 points. And watching that defensive effort right there, you wonder how much they want this game. They are getting bare tonight with plays like that one, allowing too much space for a good shooter. Dumas, he's checked in for night. Getting the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Guys, I was able to catch the message Willie Green gave to his team. He said they played well in certain areas, but the lack of detail to the defensive boards has allowed their opponent too many second chance opportunities. And that, he said, is the difference in this game. You have to get busy on the glass, Kevin. Thank you, David. So for the Pelicans, Brandon Ingram, he's checked in for Nance. Herbert Jones comes in for Dyson Daniels, and McCollum subbed in for Jose Alvarado. And here's McCollum. The feet of Alan Junis. And it's blocked. Here is Dumas. Pass to Ainge. And here's Barkley. Covered by Williamson. Good D by Williamson. And so it's Williamson with it. He brings it up for the New Orleans Pelicans. They trail by 16. And Williamson throws it down. He just punched the ticket on that one. That'll get the job done. Powerful two and jam. Feeds the Barkley. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Suns. They are dominating the paint in this one. Consistent work inside throughout the game. And just a great job converting those second chance points as well. They're having a great night getting those second and third shot opportunities. Catching up on the changes for Phoenix. West is checked in for Chambers, and it's Johnson in for Dumas. Here's Williamson, and Williamson throws it down. And once he gets clear off the screen, there is no stopping. <laughs> no, not when there's a flush waiting to happen. That's a big-time move and a big-time finish. West is screen on McCollum. Johnson with it. Now Valanciunas defending. And the rejection by Valanciunas. Now here's McCollum. Launches from deep. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. They better clear a spot on the bench for him because that's where he's headed if he continues to take shots like that. Yes, he is definitely going to the bench and maybe to the locker room. You know what? They're winning, though, despite the fact that he has just been really off. And that one's good. Ingram. Talk about making halftime adjustments. You love what they're doing with him now offensively. Timeout, timeout. timeout call, the Suns. And, and coaches looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Critical part of the game. You have to be flexible. You have to be able to adjust what you're doing. The Suns making a switch here. Marley's checked in. Johnson against McCollum. Marley kicks to Johnson. West setting the pick for Johnson. Fires for three. Out of bounds. New Orleans will take possession. A moment to check out who the New Orleans Pelicans have coming up. On Sunday, they'll defend home court against the San Antonio Spurs. Then on Tuesday, they'll start out on the road and play the Rockets in Houston. And that game against Sacramento. It's the second game of a back-to-back, -back, and you know they're going to be feeling the effects of it. Playing that much basketball in that short amount of time really takes a toll. Jonas Valanciunas, the big fella, dominate in the paint. Johnson, the pass to Bart. Out to the right wing. Here's Sabalos. Gets the three-pointer to fall. And the Suns lead by 12. That's his second three-pointer of the night. One in each half. Trying to keep the defense honest. Ingram kicks to McCullough. Back 
to Ingram. Phoenix grabs the miss. And they've controlled the boards, and that's a big reason why they're controlling the lead. Sabalos gets the bucket. Another good play. This is how they built the lead, calling on the right guys at the right time. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Ingram passes to Valanciunas. And the shot is good. The Phoenix Sea has been cut down now to just 12 on the basket from Williamson. Wow, Zion wears down the defender, and he was ready to take the last second shot. Johnson, good. And Matador defense. That's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. Here's Ingram. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Ingram's got 19 points. I like how Brandon Ingram weathers the inside coverage, fighting his way to the bucket. Suns leading by 12. Here's Johnson. And McCollum with the block. Jones, the pass to McCollum. Ingram right side. A three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. West has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Over to the left wing. Pass to Sabalos. He tries for three. Another three for Phoenix. And, and so just rolling to the finish line now in what has been a very confident-looking performance for the Suns. Free throws were a big factor in this one. You know, it, it's always great to get a lot of shots at the line, but the key they were able to convert tonight. You start making free throws, and it can get you the win. And in what's been a solid season, to say the least, tonight's game will push their win total now up to 53. And they cap off the season series with one more win. It's been nothing but W's, four straight. West to screen on Jones. Back to Johnson. Charity stripe shot, and the Suns tack on two more. Taking no chances, they go on one last run to seal the deal. Not messing around at all. They were focused, relentless, and they got the job done. McCollum dishes to Valanciunas. That falls. Nice feed that time for McCollum. Valanciunas just shrugging off the contact there to finish the play. Two-second difference between shot clock and game clock. McCollum against Johnson. Wes setting the pick for Johnson. Over McCollum, and it's Phoenix scoring again. Five seconds left here in the fourth quarter. And so it's Phoenix easily grabbing this one. They came in here and took care of business like they were the home team. And, and Kevin, how about the mental toughness that this group showed? They, they were never yes. rattled at all by the opposing fans. And that'll do it, folks. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Alford. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports.